the poetry showcase is basically from middle school and high school students uh, in our 6th Congressional District in Monmouth and uh, Middlesex counties. Uh, and I thought they were all very good, but I just you know, picked a few that I could uh, read uh, to everyone uh, today. The first is by Lily uh, Whiteman, who's in the seventh grade at Maple Place School in Oceanport. Um, and it's titled, Love That Beach, again by Lily White. Love that beach like a dolphin loves to swim. I said I love that beach like a dolphin loves to swim. Love to go in the morning, love to hear birds snoring. It's breezy and cool, sometimes really hot. I said it's breezy and cool, sometimes really hot. There could be a, a storm unless it's really warm. The pool is cool, the ocean is too. I said the pool is cool, the ocean is too, but the sand is hot, like a steamy pot. Thank you, Lily. That was Next great. Next is a poem by Bridget Zalpa, who's in grade 12 at Shore Regional High School. She's from West Long Bridge. Her poem is called Pawn. Checkmate, you said. You took my king, you stole my kingdom, you kidnapped my queen. The chessboard fell, the pieces clanked, our hearts on the floor, the look on your face. A friendly game, a set of 32, a protege at work with nothing better to do. Broken pawn on the ground, checkered board in two, thinking of the timer, maybe your dreams are broken too. I want to thank um, again um, Bridget uh, for that poem. And then the third one, is by Michael Gonzalez. He's in the seventh grade, also at Maple Place School in Oceanport. And it's called, Life is Like Baseball. Life is like baseball. I can hear the crowd cheering. I can taste the dust flying in the air. I can smell the sunflower seeds and gum being spit to the ground. I can see the team in the field ready for the batter to hit the ball. I can feel the baseball bat in my hand ready to swing. You never know if you win or lose in the game until the game is over. Thank you, Michael. That was great. And then the last one uh, is from Kelsey Nolan. She's in uh, grade seven at St. Mary's in Middletown. And it, her, hers is entitled Springtime in the Garden State. Springtime in the Garden State. Spring is the most beautiful time of the year. It fills everyone with laughter and cheer. The birds come out and the squirrels run around. The kids play their pranks while the adults eat beef franks. The bees begin to swarm and the weather gets warm. Oh, I like that too, Phil. Here, April Thanks a lot. is Poetry Month and I'll probably be reading more and we'll have other people read them because we want to share as many of the poems as possible. Uh, and I really encourage everyone uh, to participate in our poetry showcase uh, in the future. Thank you.